the University of St Andrews in Scotland. Here, Andrew Whiten considers differences between chimp mines and human mines. With unlikely tools, he and others have identified another critical advantage, and possibly a key to the human mind's stunning success. Okay. Mind reading. Will this three-year-old be able to look at things from someone else's point of view? Can she make inferences about others' thoughts? Can she spot deception? Sally. Sally, watch this. She's going to go put the marble in the basket. Are you ready? Cover it up. Okay. And then Sally's going to go out to play, like you did out in the garden. Really? Off she goes. Okay. She's going out to play, and while she's out to play, here's Naughty Anne coming, and she's going to take the marble out of the basket. While Sally is away, deceitful Anne marbles. will now hide Does Sally's marble. Ah, go in. There we go. And then Anne's going to come over here. And do you know what's happening? Where did Sally go? She went out to play. Where's she gone? She's coming back. And she's going to come and look for her favourite marble. Where's Sally going to look for her marble now? I think she's in here. Mm, you think Sally's going to look in there? Why do you think she's going to look in there? I think she'll find it. That's where it was. Through the okay. age of three, researchers have found that a child is unable to ascribe actions, motives, and beliefs to others. But by the age of five, the child's brain has developed a capacity for stepping into someone else's mind. This is Sally. Sally is coming back from playing. And Sally's going to go and look for her marble. Where is she going to look for her marble? She's going to look. Oh, where is she going to look? Basket. In the basket. Okay, shall we let her look in the basket? Yep. Oh. Why did she look in the basket? The marble could have been there, but yeah. it wasn't. Okay, so where is the marble? Do you remember? Yep. Yeah, okay. Well, do you want to help me? It varies in different children, but generally the, the four-year stage is thought of as a kind of watershed when that particular refined theory of mind ability uh, emerges. So a three-year-old would typically have difficulty with it. A five-year-old has generally mastered it. And so far, no chimpanzee has passed uh, any test of the attribution of false belief that a five-year-old child uh, passes. I suppose theory of mind you know, makes us as sublime as, as we are because we can feel for others so much, perhaps, you might say, on the one hand. At the same time, it allows us to, it allows us to be um, that much more sneaky than, than any other species on the planet.